first one, right? Rest in peace. Second one is Stuart Stale. More fire. Jamaican Stuart Stale. Jamaican Stuart Stale. Yo. This recipe was requested by one of our subscribers. You know who you are? This one's for you. For you. Guys. And it's going to be banging. So when we come back, we are making rice and peas and Jamaican stew oxtails. Lot of mercy. Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Yes, guys. So when we come back, it's, it's about, about to, to go, go down. down. the ingredients for the first dish we gonna make so the first thing we're gonna make first thing we're gonna make is the oxtails let me tell you what we put in the oxtails so the first thing you're gonna need is your oxtails we got about three to four pounds of oxtails here you're gonna need a pack of your beef bouillon guys we got this Jamaican oxtail seasoning we're going to take two tablespoons of this you get this in any supermarket okay we got all spice in here, turmeric in here. We got a few other stuff in here. That's some good stuff. Uh, paprika, red pepper, celery, onion and garlic. So you can take two tablespoons of this. Guys, we got three stalks of green onions, also known as scallions, chopped up. We got six cloves of fresh garlic, chopped up. Got your favorite, Trini Green Seasoning. Guys, three tablespoons of Trini Green Seasoning. If you haven't made this yet, Yet, you're missing out. I told y'all how to make it. Go back, look at my video, make this. A lot of recipes require this. It gives your food a better flavor. Stop procrastinating. Go make the green seasoning. Tell me how it comes out. Wait a second, how come you swole down with the green seasoning but not anything else? Huh? Miss Cleo. Hold on. Why are you interrupting me? I wanted to know, can we see the Jamaican seasoning? No. Let, no. Let's see it. No. You gave no. like five minutes to that no. green seasoning. Because I made it. Let's see the green. I'm promoting it. Let's see. No. They need to see. No. When it's sofrito up there, take your five minutes and promote your But we sofrito. need to see that Jamaican seasoning. I didn't make it. It doesn't matter. No. Anyways, guys, back to oh the ingredients. Oh my gosh. Guys, I have one and a half chopped up onions here. You're going to need... A little bit of Worcester sauce, about a tablespoon of Worcester sauce. Your thyme, you're just gonna put sprinkle. Thyme for garnish, not too much. You need know, one can of tomato sauce. Guys, what's oxtails on? The butter beans, you gotta throw the butter beans in there. You need a can of butter beans. And last but not least, you're gonna need a little bit of salt. Sprinkle of salt, sprinkle of black pepper. That's it. Now guys, Back to the green seasoning. No, 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 no. Excuse, stop playing with your mother cut now. <laughs> Let me talk. Oh, it look like somebody Shucks. somebody needs makeup. Shucks. You sweating Shucks. this time. Guys. Ooh, you look vexed. I'm going to fire you. Why you look vexed? I'm fire you in a long time. Why you look so vexed? I'm going to fire you. Anyways, guys, before I was rudely interrupted by Miss Cleo tell you every damn thing, guys, please go make this green seasoning. <sighs> Scroll back. Is you growling in my seat? That's my belly. Good. Guys, we told you how to make it. Scroll back, click that green seasoning battle of the seasoning videos where the Trini seasoning beats the sofrito. Negative. Guys, like I was saying. You should just quit. I quit! <laughs> And when we come back, I'm gonna tell you the next step. Hey guys, your favorite girl's back. And I'm ready for the next step. So, 
when we left you, you know, we had somebody who quit. But uh, thankfully, I'm here. Pull up a chair, guys. Take a seat, because Mr. Rogers is about to tell us a story. I'm here. And uh, while you were, we were gone, we took all the seasonings. We mixed, the, we mixed it in the Message! Oxtail. We let it sit. Okay? That was one for interruption. I'm counting. This is what it looks like. Message! I took, I forgot to let you guys know some point. I um, took one tablespoon of ketchup and I put it in here as well with the ingredients you saw, okay? We let it sit for a few minutes. Now, we're gonna take all of these oxtail and put it ooh, in. Ooh, ooh. Ow! Marascar maricón pendeja sucio! Oh, 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 I just had a question. What's your question? Where's the hot pepper? You know, we like it hot. Ow! That hurt. Can you get a hot pepper? I like it hot. Yes, I'll put a hot pepper. So I can't believe you hit me. Ow. I can't believe you interrupted Good, I know when I need to go to court, I'll take this video. <laughs> Abuse. So, all right. So Your Honor, I'd like a divorce. What? Why, and sir? Domestic violence. Because, because it's Valentine's Day. She gets nothing. And anyone's is hot, all right? When we are putting it in our pressure pot, we are cooking it in a pressure pot. I'm going to throw in a hot pepper family, right? So in the meantime, we're going to brown our oxtail. That's the first step. We have some oil, all right? My hand is numb. You want me to kiss it for you? No! Why? It, you got a boo-boo. It really is numb. You okay? Ow. Thank God the other hand is good to hold the, hold the camera. All right, guys, we got some uh. oil here. We put in a little bit of brown Tablespoon. sugar. Tablespoon. Tablespoon of brown sugar. Thank you. That's it, you're done for interruption. <laughs> That's what you think. All right, see if we're gonna have a next hand. <laughs> right, to brown it. So we're gonna take our oxtail. You hear that sizzling, guys? Yeah, we're coming close. We're coming close. We wanna see what you're doing, abusive. I'm gonna brown all these oxtails. I'm gonna brown one side, flip it, brown the next side. Then, as it browns, I'm gonna take it out and I'm gonna put it in this bowl, okay? All right, Ike. I'm gonna do that for the whole entire bowl. When we're done doing all of that, we're not gonna discard of the oil. Remember all those vegetables that you saw? The scallions, the onion, the garlic and stuff? When we come back, we're gonna show you guys what all this browning oxtail looks like. It's gonna be delicious. It's gonna be mouth watering, guys. All right, Ike. And we're going to take all the vegetables and we're gonna throw it in the same pan, all right? With our whole shire sauce and all the rest of the ingredients that's left, all right? So make sure you stay tuned to see what's next and what it looks like. We'll be right back. All right, Ike. Hey, chefs and chefettes. I'm back. I'm just finishing up browning the last few pieces of the oxtail. See that? Yeah, boy. Once again, we browned that in the uh, oil with the uh, light brown sugar. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna take out these pieces of oxtails and then I'm gonna saute the vegetables. So what you're gonna do now is you're gonna take all your vegetables, guys, and put them in the frying pan. Like so. Y'all see me? Let me see. Take all your vegetables. That's the onions. These are the green onions, or what we know as scallions in the Caribbean. The garlic. Put it all in there. And I'm gonna put one tablespoon of Worcester sauce. That's right. Just, just one tablespoon, guys. Get that in there. All right, so I'm gonna leave this on a low flame for about 10, 15 minutes to cook all the vegetables. See that? Get it nice and good, saute it. Guys, I wish you could smell this. 
So once this is done, once this is done cooking, I'll be right back to show you the next step. Hey guys, I'm back, and we already finished sauteing the onions and the seasonings. So what we did was we took the oxtail, we put it in our pressure cooker because we're gonna cook in a pressure cooker. Why? Because we're hungry and we want to cook it faster. If you don't have a pressure cooker, you could just cook yours in a regular pot, only it will just cook longer. So for us, it was cooked for about 35 minutes. If you have a regular pot, it'll cook for about 45 minutes. All right, so we put all of our brown oxtail, as you can see, in our pot. We have our sauteed onions still in this pot. We have our buttered beans, we drain out the water. We have our tomato sauce. If you don't have it, use tomato paste, which is fine. We're gonna put our can of tomato sauce. You don't have none, use ketchup. Use ketchup. We did put ketchup already in there where we marinated it, but you could definitely use some more ketchup. Gives it a good flavor, guys. It sure does. All right, we put our tomato sauce, mix it around there. I guess it is such a good color. I'm gonna show you guys in two seconds what it looks like. I'm gonna show you the moon in. Can you see that or I need to lift up the pot? We can see it. Guys, you need to invest in a pressure pot because the way this is smelling, I wish I could eat this right now. Can you smell it? Nah. I'm gonna take all the sauteed onions, I'm gonna pour them right in here. Onions, garlic, scallions, all of that. Mmm. Bang it. I'm gonna take our butter beans, throw them right in there. The purpose of us throwing it at the end, guys, well, almost towards the end, is because you don't wanna put your beans in too early because you don't want it to get mushy, all right? So wait towards the end when we're about to, right before we add the water. Cause then it'll cook at a good temperature and it'll be perfect. Just right. Just right. So now we're gonna add our water. I have here about four cups of water. It should be just enough for our pot to add right above the oxtail. Hopefully I'll spill it. So you wanna add enough water to go above the oxtail. Not too much because then you're gonna lose the flavor. That should be enough. See, I even have a little bit extra. So how long that's gonna cook in a pressure cooker? This is gonna cook about 30 minutes. And if we didn't have a pressure cooker, how long would it cook in the regular pot? I told them in the beginning, 45 minutes, maybe 50 minutes. You can always check it to make sure it's tender and the meat's falling off the bone. Yeah. Mmm, oxtails. Get you a pressure cooker, I'm just saying. Guys, get a pressure cooker. They even have those electric ones now. You set it and forget it. Oh my God, those are so good. Expensive, but good. And in those, you could brown everything all in one. And it's safer too. I heard some stories about pressure cookers exploding. Oh my God, yes. Yeah, I ain't touching it. I ain't messing with no pressure cooker. <laughs> no thank you. Guys, we're gonna lock it. We're gonna put up our flame a little bit, and that's it. And when we come back, we're gonna show you the finished product. So make sure you stay in tune with us. We'll be back. Hey guys. Irie, what a guan. Food is done. Oxtail done, Jared. Oxtail dance. Oxtail dance. You don't like my dance? No. I, don't, I didn't like any of your dances. Ooh, that hurt. <laughs> that hurt. Sorry. Uh, I'm gonna give you some dance lessons. Nah, no, please don't. Please don't. Please yeah. Don't. No, nope, I nope. know what you was doing. Nope, I don't want to look like a fool. I don't want to look like a fool. But guys, the oxtail is done. Shout out to Tabby and Macho for requesting this dish. This one is for you guys. I'm hungry, I'm ready to eat. It tastes banging because we took a little, you know, you gotta sample the food, you know? 
Um, we're going to drop pictures of what it looks like. Don't don't get don't get don't get bumped out of the uh, scene. Don't do that. All right, guys. So that's it. Oh, oh, oh. oxtail's done. I'm about to show you pictures, guys. If you like our recipe, make sure y'all comment, like, and, and subscribe. And you're gonna thank us for this one. This one is right from the island. Doom, no, no, no. That was good. All right, that's it, guys. Yeah. Happy Valentine's Day. Come on, we're going to get copyright. Stop. Oh, Stop. Okay. Stop. <laughs> Stop. Yo, that's it, guys. And we, we are. are